Hey guys, what's up? I'm back with this new video of this unboxing of some camera things. So here's the camera, the DSCWX500, the Amazon Basics tripod, and yeah, here's the case which I got free with the camera, and here's the clip which I got free with the tripod. So let's get started unboxing with the tripod at first. So guys, here's the tripod, the Amazon Basics tripod. Well, now starting with the going behind the box you see that there are some details provided about it the cost uh, manufacturer from where is imported and all the stuffs how to use it i don't have time to read those i'll just cut the seal directly guys so now opening the box Ooh, i find a tripod a mini tripod i guess that's a tabletop tripod must be one and a half feet or something like that so it's pretty much comfortable and um, the top is rotating and it's loose and you need to tighten it by that adjuster at the side so set the angle you need and just tighten it that's it that's pretty much it so just you can use it as a monopod or as a tripod so basically it's for shooting the videos i just got it for shooting the videos so here's a clip which is for resting your mobile onto it and shoot the videos it's same like resting the camera but instead of the camera in here you'll be placing the mobile and just screwing it onto the let's say the tripod so now getting down it represents a selfie stands top well that's pretty much the same purpose i have got this well it has this retractable clip and now Let's just try it on, putting it on, I'm just screwing it guys, just putting it and screwing it, oh it's too loose, I need to get adjusted to it very fast, mm -hmm. I'm screwing it, screwing it, screwing it, screwing it, yep. screwing it, so yeah, that's it, mm, that's pretty much, you can use it as a monopod or a tripod or a selfie stick. Well, multi-purpose tabletop tripod with this clip. And just adjust it and shoot videos, photos on the move. That's good. Now we're coming to this uh, camera. The camera is a Sony DSC WX500 model. Hmm, that's pretty much heavy box. The price quoted here is 459 Singaporean dollars. Well, that's uh, 20, 20,000K in Indian rupees. So now, the camera and the case together. To the case now this case is just like a carry pouch to make the camera portable you can't carry that huge box with you everywhere you go so it's a bit rugged in my opinion it's rough material just open the zip put in your camera here and the next zip is provided to carry your accessories like the battery the usb charger and all the stuff you can see this image guys oh sorry the image has been cut I just adjust my angle yeah you can see the images guys the camera has been inserted there the battery has been inserted there they show how to use it it's just an instruction manual keep it inside come to the camera the sony camera wow it looks really premium that image that price hmm i guess it must be worth it please do be worth it you must be worth it must be so this image itself says that the camera is pretty much good looking yeah but i got a red one guys not a black one so before going to unboxing let me just see around the box on the top you can see about the features of the camera oh that's a big list you know so the zeiss lens the xmor or simos sensor Bion's X Wi-Fi certified that's great it can transfer files on the go NFC 4k video shooting full HD 1080p video shooting sorry guys that's uh image shooting 4k image shooting XAVC video format AVC HD format Dolby digital stereo creator multi-port HDMI memory stick HDXC card triluminous display panel and the apps which it is compatible with the battery is uh, suitable for shooting 400 shots approximately 
Guys, I don't know many of the formats which is being described here. I need to do some research. I'll be letting you know in my further videos on this. So, on the side, you can see that the LCD panel has been retractable. It's shown retractable. That means that you can take selfies with ease. Hmm. So, 18.2 megapixel CMOS sensor, XMOR, 13 to optical zoom, up to 16 to clear image zoom, 180 degree tiltable LCD. That's what I was thinking about. You can shoot selfies guys with ease so now unboxing opening it you find the regular uh, regulatory information the warranty guide all those setup manuals and all those so i just feel bored see guys i said you it's the manuals and all those stuff i don't have time to read all those it just makes me sleepy guys let me just put it aside or throw it away uh popping it out yep that's not Oh guys, pushing all those uh, documents out, you can see that there's some features mentioned about the camera, some details worth reading it, I guess. So now inside is a USB charging wire, the USB charging adapter, micro USB guys, micro USB. So here is a camera wrapped in a plastic cover, plastic cover, yeah, plastic cover. So this is the plastic cover. Just removing it out, just pulling it out. Ooh, get the camera. Wow, it's really lustrous, shiny, beautiful, premium, guys. So, guys, let me just on it. So, where's the button? So, I'm just taking a look at it. Oh, there's some button by mistake I popped. Oh, it's a flash popping button, a retractable flash. That's really different, guys. The. Um, Tiltable LCD panel, 180 tiltable. Wow, it's really helpful for me shooting selfies. Hmm. So in the below, you can see the normal battery place, the battery available place, and the SD card port. Let me just lock it back. Now that's where I will be attaching my tripod and be testing. Now that's the mic. That's the USB port, some sort of USB port. I don't know where they're given that. So, to the side, to the multi port, where is the normal USB port which you can use for data transfer, charging, uh, and all the stuff. Now, this is Wi Fi certified, as I said before, and it is NFC enabled. So, that's really useful for transferring data. So, now let me just on the camera. You can see that, guys, the lens just popped out from inside and the covering just opened. So that's clicking that one small button. Let me just shoot some photos guys quickly to see how fast is the shutter speed. It's pretty much good autofocus it has. The screen's really bright guys, I need to adjust it. The shutter speed was really good, but processing the image took some time. Well, I guess that's shooting some high-end photos. I just shot some uh, photos guys here as you all can see this flower pots which I shot at natural lighting now these are some buildings which I shot from my home you can see the colors are shown really vibrant and the sunlight has been captured but it's been a white spot now this is a flower pot which I shot from a distance from my home to the neighbor's spot well that's a really good distance now this is the bouquet effect or the macro effect as mentioned in the camera it really shows all the details crisp and clear that's really good about this camera guys now this one was shot in movement hurry well that's really a damn big blur now this is one of my favorite photos guys i just shot this leaf thing from a very distance very big distance now this is a low lighting photo which I shot in my room. Uh, well, it's pretty much uh, shady. See, now this was shot with the flash. The flash is really bright, in my opinion. You all can see that the box is sparkling due to the light. Now this was again shot with minimum lighting and no flash. So guys, you can you can see that blurry image. Sorry for that. Now this was shot in artificial lighting in my photo table. Well, it really shows all the details of the box. 
Hmm. Now this was again shot in low lighting, and the lighting was pretty much artificial. Hmm. Yep, it's great. So now, a selfie with my partner, the Mickey Mouse. Hmm. This was pretty much different. Now I shot this photo with the LCD panel tilted, guys. So this was better than the previous one the selfie so guys that's it for this unboxing video of this sony camera i'll be posting about this in depth in my further videos on this hope you guys liked it and enjoyed it please do share this video and subscribe to my channel if you're new to my channel thank you